Hey guys, it's Matthew from Bliss Collects. We have another nickel box to hunt. Let's get it open and see if there's any unders on the other side because this side, there's no obvious ones. Let's just open it up and take a look. Hey guys, the box is open. <clears throat> we have one that looks like it'll be an ender at least. The demon mark, otherwise, looks pretty normal. Let's get to the hunt and see what's on the inside. Goal number one, we have our first find. It's an S mint mark, nice reverse. Hoping for a 30s nickel. It's not 30s, but it's a pretty nice 1940s. I'll take it. Let's keep on hunting. Same roll. We have a 1955 nickel. Minted out of Denver yet again. Since the last box, we're still hoping for the P mint mark. Let's hope it's in here. Very next roll. We have a 1941 nickel. Minted out of Philly. We'll take it. Let's keep on hunting. Hey guys, roll number three. We have a pretty nice reverse, and I think it'll be an Aldi. Philly Mint Mark, 1941. Two nicer nickels, four total finds. Three rolls in, let's hope it keeps up. Roll number nine. We have our next find. Another pretty nice condition, 1940 nickel. Minted out of Philly. We'll take it. Let's keep on hunting. Roll number 10. We might have a war nickel along this roll. You can come to see this pretty dark edge. I know it just looks like a dirty nickel, but it's pretty worn to me. So you guys won't see this if it's not a war nickel, because you know why would you? But let's just check. And it is. It's got a Philly mint mark on the back. Made in 1943. We'll always take silver. We'll take it. Let's keep on hunting. Same roll. We have a 1954 nickel. Minted out of Denver. We'll take it. Let's continue the hunt. Roll 12. We have a 1957 nickel. Minted out of Denver. We'll take it. Let's keep on hunting. Same roll. We have a 1953 nickel. Minted out of Denver. We'll take it. I'll bring you in on the next one. Roll 13. We have an ender. Don't know if I showed you this. Just found it when I flipped the roll around. There you can see a 1947. Let's open it up and check what mint mark it is. We have it open. Here's the 47. Minted out of Philly. And back here I did see some older lettering. Yeah, it'll probably just be a 64. Yep. We'll take it. I'll bring you in on the next find. Roll 15. We have a 1948 nickel. Minted out of Philly. I'll take it. Let's keep on hunting. Okay, guys, another horrible dime box. We'll make it quick because we're not stopping until we find a good find. All we had were these proof reverses plus this really nice 1966 dime. Okay, let's move on to the next box. Roll 14, nope, 16, sorry. We have our next find. Right here is a 1940 nickel, minted out of Philly. We'll take it, let's keep on hunting. Same roll, we have a 1987 Canadian nickel. We'll always take these even though it's not a better one. We lose a little money, but it's still a cool find. And let's continue the hunt. Roll 19, we have a 1946 nickel. Minted out of Philly. We'll take it. Let's keep on hunting. Roll 21. We have our fourth 1940 nickel. Minted out of Philly again. We'll take it. Let's keep on hunting. Next roll. We have a 1947 nickel. Minted out of Denver this time. We'll take it. Let's continue the hunt. Roll 23. We have an ender. 1954, if you can see it. A little hard to show. Well, it's there. Let's open it up and check what mint mark. It's a 1954, minted out of Denver. I'll take it. Let's keep on hunting. Roll 25. We have a Canadian nickel and a possible find. Let's figure out where the Canadian nickel went. There it is. 1999, take it. 
And then this one looked like a possible oldie. Nope, just a 62. We'll take it still. Let's keep on hunting. Roll 28. We have our next find. It's a 1959 nickel. Minted out of Denver. We'll take it. Let's continue the hunt. Roll 30. We have yet another 1940 nickel. This time it's minted out of San Francisco. We'll take it. Let's continue the hunt. Roll number 31. We have a 1957 nickel. Minted out of Denver. A little damage. Still take it. Let's keep on hunting. Hey guys, roll number 30, uh, 33, yeah. And we have a pretty nice find. Look at this 1958 nickel. Wow, it's a stunner. Let's see if it has any steps. It's a Denver mint mark. Looks like it might even have some steps. Well, that's a pretty nice find. Always take that. Let's keep on hunting. Roll 34. We have our next find. It's a 1946 nickel. Minted out of Philly. I'll take it. Let's continue the hunt. Roll 35. We have our next find, I think. It's a pretty old reverse with a Denver mint mark. It's actually decent condition. Let's hope it's older. And it's 1948. Pretty nice 1948. Always take that. Let's keep on hunting. Roll 36. We have our 1958 nickel here. It's a 1958. Denver with some gunk on it, but we'll always take that. Let's keep on hunting. Roll 40. We have our next find. And there's probably three of them actually by the look of it. Right here. I think there will be one. Denver Mint Mark, 1957. Back here, there was one. A 56D as well. And this one behind it looks pretty suspicious. P Mint Mark, 1946. I'll take them. Let's keep on hunting. Roll 42. We have an old reverse. Denver Mint Mark, made in 1959. I'll take it. Let's keep on hunting. Roll number 46. We have our next find. 1953 nickel. Minted out of Denver. We'll take it. Let's continue the hunt. Roll 49. We have our next find. And if you can see it right there, we have beaded edge. Which means we have a Canadian. 1985, we'll take it. Let's keep on hunting. Okay, the box is finished, and here's a wrap up. We had three Canadians, quite a few 1940 nickels, like five of them, which is quite a bit. 241s, 346s, 247s, 248s, 253s, 254s, a 56, five, 56, 357s, Two fifty eights, including this one, a forty three and two fifty nines, with a grand total of five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven oldies, which is quite a good amount, plus a lot of forties. And then the three Canadians we'll always take silver, that makes it a great box. And this one should upgrade either of my albums, my good one or my one from Just Coin Roll Hunting. Let's see if it has any steps again. Forgot if I've shown you. There might be one or two. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, and share. Have a great day.